everyone welcome back to my channel hope you all are well and doing great um, so yeah today I'm going to talk about elf on the shelf um, as you can see he's right here <laughs> It's right here hanging on the Christmas tree. Um, so I'm going to keep share some ideas um, you can try. I'll share five ideas you can try with your kids. Elf on the Shelf is such a lovely Christmas tradition. Um, basically, the elf will come into the home towards the ending of November or in the in the beginning of December and the elf's duty is to report back to Santa with the naughty or nice list so this is a very good tradition if you want your kids to be well behaved in the run-up to Christmas um, since I've got this elf I feel like my kids have been of their best behavior uh, and anytime they try to be naughty I just remind them that oh the elf is watching and then they try to be good again so yeah so um, this is the first time we're ever ever going to have Elf on the Shelf and I feel like my kids are at the right age when they can have this sort of tradition because one of them is six and the other is four so they kind of understand what the whole process is like. Uh, so our Elf came in this box and when you open the box the Elf was sitting right here and this is a storybook that just talks about the story of the elf on the shelf tradition and um yeah so i'll just show you guys you know quickly how it looks and you know these are the pictures in the book and it's such a, a lovely lovely book you know if you want to read it to your kids and explain what the whole process is about so they've got some ideas here as well the kids are not meant to touch the elf um, if not the elf will lose his magic and um, that is one thing that I've told the kids so, so that they don't have to squish him and break his head or something you know so yeah it's really funny and then um, the kids have named him Fred there are different fun ideas that you can do with the kids um, with the elf and um, I'm just gonna share a few ideas that you can do sometimes the elf can be mischievous and um, you could have like a toilet roll that the elf has unrolled and you know just made a mess around the house yeah so you could do that as well one idea is to have the elf help the kids get ready for school so you could pop the elf by the kids uniforms or you could pop the elf by the kids sponges so that they can get ready to have their bath or dress up for school another good one is for you to keep maybe breakfast on the table or a snack and have the elf on the table with the snack or the food you know ready for the children to eat it um, that's if you want the you know the elf to be nice you could hide a treat in a stocking filler and um, you know put the elf there guarding it so that the children do not go to the stocking filler before Christmas or you know you could put a gift under the Christmas tree and put the elf there just to safeguard it so that no one goes there to touch it so the last one is to have the elf in the kitchen doing something crafty in the kitchen or you know hanging on a balloon or something or sometimes the elf can just do exactly what it is meant to do sit on a shelf so here you can see that the elf is safeguarding that treat right there inside the Christmas tree so when the kids wake up in the morning they're going to find the elf you know safeguarding their treats right here you can see that the elf is wearing one of the kids glasses <laughs> and the elf is sitting on a garland so when the kids wake up in the morning um, they can always find the elf doing this and it's such a lovely lovely idea so I like to set my, my puzzles in the morning for the kids to work out Another good idea is to have the elf eat some Pringles. <laughs> so once the kids come to the dining in the morning to have their breakfast, they're going to see the elf helping himself with a lovely snack early in the morning. Here you can find the elf doing some tree climbing antiques, <laughs> climbing trees and being 
such a mischievous little elf this is another good fun way and idea for you to try another good one is to have the elf help out with the washing imagine when the kids you know come down and then they find the elf <laughs> helping out with the washing and being so silly you know this is another good idea for you to try so here the elf is about to put on the tv and watch something on the tv so i hope these ideas have been very useful to you please let me know in the comments what you get up to with your elf and will you be keeping that christmas tradition with your kids um, i would love to hear down below thank you so much for watching and please do not forget to hit the like button subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you can get instant notifications each time i share a new